Okay, now that I have this, I'm going to do the following. I'm going to cut this. I am going to Then I'm going to do this data validation. You will understand what I'm doing later. Ribbon, design mode, insert, NactiveX combo box. I'm going to type this here. I'm going to put this here. I'm going to click on properties, combo box, and here I call it combo markets. Okay, combo. Okay, I have my own. So properties, I click here and I give the name to this. Okay, then this is going to be linked link sound is this one send country okay that's good so and then this object is the one that will be populated here so with sheet one where i have my dashboard this one sheet one dot combo markets dot add item this okay as simple as that and this one I'm going to call it when I open my workbook. Open and I'm going to do this. And at the very beginning, I'm going to make it empty, clear, like this. Okay, so what happened? If I go into my file here, to my combo box here, there is nothing. I'm gonna close this. I'm gonna save. I'm gonna close my file. I'm going to reopen it. Here we are. And here we are. I have all my markets automatically. What happened if, for example, I'm going to add here another one. And I call it DE for Germany. I'm going to Okay, or I could save it, open, okay, gonna I'm going to remove Germany, I'm gonna reopen the file, okay, open, I'm gonna see, and I get exactly my four markets. And what happened here, okay, I have this cell country range is equal to this value. I don't have and before I, okay, remove this. Calculation, this is an L. Dashboard, as we Sweden, will be updated exactly as I did before. I can also make it a bit better. Design mode. Style option. So if I'm going to select this, you see I have like this, or even style. And the other one it seems like I can edit here yeah, only select this okay so as you can I upload my file I just specify in which directory I'm going to do this job and I'm done as simple as that
Okay.